Hey Cancer, welcome to the Cancerian Vibe. I am your girl, the Boss Lady B. Thank you so, so much for joining me. If you're new to the channel, Cancer, it's all things Cancer over this way, so you might as well hit that subscribe button and join the fam, boo, okay? We cater to the Cancer over here on the Cancerian Vibe, so join in. Join in <clears throat> on the love, Cancer. Um, if you're new to the channel, I'm a Cancer, so hey, yeah. Hey y'all. Um, but anyway, so you guys, I'm here doing a um I'm gonna see what's coming towards cancer. So yeah, if you have cancer anywhere in your uh chart, this reading could resonate for you. Um, and it's meant to be or intended to be a timeless message. So whenever this reading finds you, that's when it was meant. Um, but you guys check out my main tarot page. I do um the monthly readings for cancer over on my main tarot page and if i remember i'll link it in the i <clears throat> so you all can check me out over there um over on boss lady b tarot but yeah i'm gonna pull i don't know what kind of spread i want to do i think i'm gonna pull two of the um the psychic tarot um two of these and then clarify them and then end it with a um wisdom of the oracle so yeah <clears throat> Let's just see. Thank you, Spirit, for clear, accurate messages for my cancers. What is okay, Cancer? Cancer! Look at this! Destiny! We got the, <clears throat> the number 10, Destiny. So, look, what's coming towards Cancer is Destiny. And we got accelerated motion here at the bottom of the deck. So, look, I feel like you are on your way, Cancer. You are on your way to what is meant for you. Um, and I feel like it's tied to abundance here for you. With this being a number eight card. But, oh, yes. And I'm so glad I picked up this card. Because I was just about to say, you know. And I'm not saying abundance in just a financial form. Because I feel like can't say you're getting closer and closer to love. And, but bam we got the Ace of Cups right, be <laughs> right below it with the love begin. So, yeah, can't say. I definitely feel like somebody may be taking accelerated motion towards you, coming towards you. Like this may be destiny, a destined, uh, destined connection coming towards you here. <clears throat> Interesting with the love begins right after it. So look, it's destiny. And then, okay, y'all, it might definitely be um, a connection coming towards you here. I'm going to actually, you know, destiny... I'm going to actually read the meaning of this card, uh, the message behind it, too. Um, but we got harmony that came out. So, y'all, you could definitely be moving toward, or somebody could definitely be moving in towards you fast with this. Um, um, and wanting to come in and have a connection here with you. And it's funny that harmony came out, harmony and destiny. Um, but we have obstacles and challenges here at the bottom of the deck. So, I feel like there could have been some... Um, there could be some obstacles that this person who's coming in had to overcome. It's kind of like a break in the um, the way towards you. But I feel like it's all destiny. Because um, it's like... Whatever happened or whatever um, challenges this person had to overcome. Maybe there was some conflict in another situation that they were having to get out of. Y'all, it's turning into a love reading slick. I feel like... Because I feel like somebody is taking accelerated motion towards cancer. And it could be a Leo, y'all. <clears throat> this Leo, I don't know, this fire sign um, been showing up in, in cancer's readings. Hmm. Show yourself. <laughs> Show yourself. Okay, but I'm going to read the message for... Um, for um, the destiny card. And you know, it's kind of like the wheel of fortune here in the regular tarot deck. So definitely, you know, like good luck here. I feel like things are turning in your favor here, Cancer. So yeah, um, it says good luck and fortune are now um, in your favor. A cycle of change, success and growth is imminent. Life ebbs and flows in the natural journey and the destiny card signifies that good karma has come full circle. So yes, Cancer. Um, it's time to get the fruits of your labor. What you sowed, you are about to reap, okay? Open up your heart and accept and receive what you've earned. Opportunities, whether expected 
or unexpected are knocking at your door. This is a, so that's, you know, somebody, I feel like cancer, <clears throat> I'm sorry, just sign up real quick. I feel like um, cancer, somebody may be expecting like, um, a financial breakthrough or something they may be expecting like maybe you're going on job interviews and they're going well or like you feel like there's um something happening for you as far as finances but for some of you I feel like what's unexpected that's coming towards you that's a part of this destiny is this um this partnership this balanced harmonious um loving partnership that's coming in and going to offer you stability here cancer okay my bad um it says, <laughs> this is the time to allow your problems to be replaced by solutions. Believe in destiny as you learn to let go of old issues. You're being given the chance to understand the lessons and gain the wisdom from the past, enabling you to move steadily forward in a positive direction, holding on to a strong belief that you deserve to be happy and prosperous and have abundance in all areas of your life is the key. This confident mindset will show you that the impossible can indeed become the possible. With this card, take advantage of all opportunities, act now, take responsibility for your actions, and enjoy the fact that destiny is presently in your favor. Don't always rely on luck, however, but the will most definitely will turn again. So yeah, and I and I feel like, you know, that's life, Cancer, and you know that, Um you got to take the good with the bad. And I feel like, Karen, so we've had our share of the bad and the wheel is turning and it's turning in our favor. Like it's our turn is next. You know, we were in the wheel. We were in the, what do you call the little thing at the um fair, the Ferris wheel. We were in the Ferris wheel and we were, we, we were itching our way up to the top. We were, we were itching our way up to the top. I feel like there may have been some obstacles and challenges that we've had to overcome cancer to get to the top but i see you look it's your moment cancer it's your moment um but i definitely i'm sorry to say cancer we're about to see um yeah i feel like there was there's been like a lot of conflict or a lot of like um defeat defeativeness or you know a feeling of lack i feel like that has been cancer's energy you may have been feeling like you lack something or you lack what you need. And that's not the case, Cancer. Um, you know, I get it. Like I said, like I told y'all, I'm a Cancer too. So I definitely feel like there may have definitely been some challenges here for Cancer. But keep faith, hold on, Cancer, okay? Because destiny is here to take over. And um, give you the fruits of your labor. And this loving connection that I feel like is going to just um yeah <laughs> just rounds out <laughs> just round out things perfectly for you um cancer because we got the eight of wands that came out but look here at the bottom of the deck we have the lovers here so cancer you um i feel like this is a soulmate connection that's coming in here for you this may also be good news here coming in something i feel like there's so many opportunities coming in here for you can't so you're gonna have to make a decision um it's gonna be like a hard decision i feel like so much is coming in here for you for you can't so you're gonna have to say no <clears throat> tell me about destiny for cancer yes see you oh yeah. what what did i tell you cancer with the ace of wands coming out so yeah this is definitely a look I feel like new opportunities coming in here for you, Cancer. New opportunities that are going to make you um, financially um, stable, financially abundant here. And I feel like, yes, it's everything that you've been wishing for. But there's that five of pentacles. There's that energy of feeling like there's a lack or like you're left out in the cold. Maybe you feel like um, these things that you were working on, they weren't going to pan out. I don't know, Cancer, <laughs> what the energy is, but this destiny i'm feeling look a lot of passion and com coming in here for you i feel like passion as far as career and passion as far as love and romance um tell me about harmony here for cancer tell me about harmony here for cancer and I can't say whoever this person is, I feel like they really, 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 one, they might be older, more mature with the emperor here coming out. Um, and it, um, look at here, that fire sign, it could be an Aries that you're dealing with. 
Um, but I feel like they like they know what they want and they really, really want you. Love you, Cancer. Um, with the Three of Cups here at the bottom of the deck, you all could be celebrating something here soon. You could be celebrating, you could be selling this, um, celebrating this, look at that, celebrating this good news, all these opportunities here for you that are coming in, Cancer. It's kind of like, <clears throat> they just come out of nowhere. The wheel turns and like, all of a sudden, the doors open. It's like that perfect key, that perfect key here turns and the wheel opens for Cancer. Tell me about, um, yeah, look. With the Knight of Swords, definitely. I told you this person, whoever they are, Cancer, look, I feel like they were waiting on the perfect moment to come in and reveal themselves, but they are coming in hot. Whoever it is, like, look, they are coming in and, like, closing in on Cancer here. Yeah, and it's coming full circle here. Look, this person is going to come in with a bang here, too. Like, they're going to cause some ruckus here. Um, I feel like they may take you by surprise. But they come in with good vibes here. This person, this person, whoever this person is, they're very mature. Like, I get, they may be older than you, Cancer. I'm going to have to do a love reading and see who this, who this fire sign is coming towards Cancer. Let me know in the comments if y'all want that next. Um... Who is this fire sign coming towards Cancer? Tell me about the Eight, eight of uh, Wands here. Y'all, and it could be somebody that you know. I'm sorry. I know some, pe some people don't want to hear that. Some people don't be wanting to hear that sometimes. Um, and like, you know, take what resonates, sleep what doesn't. You do have free will here. If you don't want somebody back, you don't have to take somebody back. Um, that is not what I'm sitting up here telling you to do at all, honey. Okay. Tell me about this eight of wands for a cancer. Oh, yeah. So, look. I feel like cancer with this three of swords coming out. I feel like this is this good news coming because I feel, look. I feel like you're in this energy with this five of pentacles. This, um, that kind of five of pentacles energy. You're depressed and upset. I feel like you think something isn't working out for you. Or something didn't work out for you. But there's good news coming in to um, to offset that. You were worried about something here. Maybe you were worried about... Maybe you felt like destiny was leaving you out. Yeah, you were sitting here waiting. And it could have been you were waiting on your money here too. <laughs> Cancer. Tell me about this Ace of Wands. Look. <laughs> Tell me about this Ace of Wands here for Cancer. Y'all, so look, the um, Knight of Wands came, I mean, the Knight of Cups came out. And we got the lover back here on the bottom of the deck. So this definitely, look, this could be somebody coming in with a passionate love offer. Cancer, this is somebody, I'm getting soulmate vibe for somebody here with the lovers here at the bottom of the deck. Um, You also could have had an ending here with a Gemini for somebody here. I'm getting that. But yeah, I feel like somebody's coming in with um, like somebody's coming towards cancer with a cup of love, wanting to offer you a cup of love, and it really does seem like a fire sign. <laughs> um, tell me about the emperor here. Tell me about the emperor here for cancer. Tell me about the emperor. Oops. So, okay, we got the nine of wands that came out. So, Cancer, you might um, actually be intimidated by this person. You might be intimidated by them coming in because I feel like they come in knowing what they want. And that may kind of like throw you off. You may you may not be um, ready to receive love because I feel like you got some other, you had some other stuff that you were clearing out. But it um it looks like it moves you towards your stability. So it's kind of like you can put your guard down here with this person. With this um fire sign. Tell me about the Knight of Swords here for Cancer. So yeah, oh, ooh, Cancer. Look, definitely could be dealing with the Leo here with the sun coming out. 
But somebody's coming in wanting to offer you, um, wanting a new beginning here in love. With the Ace of Cups here at the bottom of the deck, they they wanting a um a success with you, like okay, Cancer. All right, look, we gonna have to get to the love readings for real. Definitely somebody coming in. I think um uh, trying to move you past this past heartbreak and heartache. If you're still holding on to that, you may not even know it. For somebody, Cancer, for some reason, Cancer, I feel like you might be on um. You might be on guard and not even like you might be repelling things and you don't even know because you're you're just naturally protective. You know, you have your heart out of shell, so it's no different to you. But cancer, I feel like for somebody you're needing to be told to kind of open up. I see good vibes, good things coming in here for cancer. Good things coming in here for cancer. And yeah, we got round and round here at the bottom of the deck of the pre-shuffle cancer. It very well could be somebody. Um, if you know of a fire sign. They could want reconciliation, but yeah. <laughs> Let's see. I'm gonna pull one card for the spread. Give me. All right. Give me a card for cancer. Give me a card for cancer. Ooh, cancer. Ooh, cancer. So we got. Oh, I'm sorry. Serendipity that came out. So look, this is, you're about to move into some extreme happiness here. Um, and I feel like things could be definitely changing here for you, Cancer. Um, look, there could be definitely a lot of endings. The way my deck split, y'all, and I saw these cards. Work in the road and time to go. I feel like Cancer, that's where you are. You might be at a fork in the road and trying to decide. There may be a lot of things that are ending here for you, Cancer. Um, this is just me going off the cuff, and I promise I'm going to close the reading. Um, but there may be a lot of things here changing for you, Cancer. And, you know, Cancers don't really handle change that well. Um, but I feel like, look, you're needing to be told <laughs> look, what lies beyond this um, is going to make you extremely happy, extremely um serendipitous this connection that's coming in here for for you cancer i feel like it's gonna make all the difference this new beginning in love with this ace of cups destiny is coming to um destiny is coming to give you a, a good old payback <laughs> um yeah i love that um let's see i'm gonna pull one more let me get one more here for cancer Y'all, I don't know why my cards. Give me one more here for Cancer. So we got, oh yeah, we got a higher power that came out. So Cancer, I definitely feel like, look, the universe is definitely, um, I don't know if y'all can tell that card. Um, the universe is definitely here um, working in your favor. I feel like this is um, destiny. This is out of your, out of your hands now. It's kind of like some events are about to happen that are just going to have to happen here. But in the end, um, you'll be happy because of it. Happy because of it. There may be some endings here too, Cancer. Yeah, look at here. There may be some endings here too. And you may be going round and round about these endings. But look, let it go because... So much new and better is coming in for cancer. I'm really, really excited. I'm loving the energy. Um, I'm going to leave it right there, y'all. My bad. Um, remember to like, share, and subscribe to the channel, you guys. Until next time. Love ya.